Well, good evening. How's everyone doing? Uh, MDEF was a sponsor of the wine and beer. So. Um, first of all, I'd like to congratulate Cruz I.O. and the city of Santa Cruz. Uh, at MDEF, we're all about public-private partnership, and I think this is a great example of the city and a private company in our region uh, working well together. In particular, I'd like to congratulate Peggy and Chris and uh, Cruz I.O. Fiber and the whole team here. Uh, not only are they have been in business a long time, they own the own old Sentinel building, but uh, they're examples of local entrepreneurs who have built a business in Santa Cruz. And I think we all have a lot should have a lot of gratitude for people who invest in our community and make it better through the work of their labor and the services they provide to our community. Um, MBEP, the Monterey Bay Economic Partnership, is here because one of our goals is high-speed fiber at affordable prices with access for all of our citizens. And a lot of the things that have been mentioned already uh, that the cities and counties are doing in terms of dig once, uh, Brad will talk about UCSC's efforts, but we've recently installed a fiber line from Santa Cruz to Soledad through a company called Tunisis thanks to the efforts of UCSC and uh, the Central Coast Broadband Coalition. And so a lot of these things, uh, MBEP has a big focus on the tech ecosystem and the meetup space like you see here at Cruz.io or at NextSpace. Um, we now have acceler an accelerator here through Santa Cruz Works to build startups and incubate startups and also one down in, in Salinas. Um, the UCSC Hackathon, uh, we have Santa Cruz Tech Beat, we have the Santa Cruz New Tech Meetup. All of these things have come together over the last four years and are really indicative of this burgeoning and thriving tech ecosystem that we have. And fiber and fast internet speeds at affordable prices for everyone is at the absolute foundation of that uh, ecosystem. So I'm just super excited about seeing so much of this that we had envisioned and that Cruz I.O. had envisioned 25 years ago, 30, 30 uh, years ago, all coming together now uh, in Santa Cruz. And it's not just about tech. You know, a lot of people say, well, this is great for the tech environment. It's not just about tech. It's about every sector. Uh, Martine and David have referred to this a little bit, in that whether it's transparency and access to our government or telemedicine and being able to move big files, big radiology files or MRI files around to different hospitals and healthcare providers or to a specialist across the country or across the world. Um, you know, it's about distance learning and having kids have access to the best knowledge all over the world. Uh, and as David mentioned, you know, just for consumer apps, for our homes, uh, for FaceTime, for looking at movies, uh, et cetera. For our marine science centers that are so important here in the Monterey Bay Sanctuary for weather data, for other kinds of sensor data, for about the tides and so forth. All of that comes together on the internet. And when we have fast, ubiquitous access, uh, just like the national highway system, created something in the 1960s, we're now building the national data system. And I think we can all take our hats off to Cruz IO, to Cruz IO Fiber, or Santa Cruz Fiber, and to uh, the city for working together uh, to make this happen in downtown Santa Cruz. Thank you from, uh, from MBEP and uh, for all of our participants today for coming together and making this happen. Thank you.